Welcome back to another Dragon Ball Strongest Warrior video. Alright, uh, so I've been working on Gotenks, uh, doing up his, uh, I, I guess you call him martial arts scroll, because when I try to translate it, it says martial arts level with all the scrolls and that. And um, I noticed I'm very close to getting a whole new level on the, uh, I don't really know what it's called either, it's like a shield. <clears throat> And uh, different elements. I've got um, five reds that are blue, five golds that are blue, etc., etc. Then there's teams of uh, gold and green, red and blue, stuff like that. I'll show you what I mean in a second. I just uh, get through this. So this Gotenks is pretty good, by the way. He's pretty strong. But uh, unlike the other one, his ability is uh, so much stronger when he uses his special. But this one, the ability isn't as strong, but his limit is better. So like we can uh, limit the ability of the other player and cause massive damage while keeping range. Still pretty cool. Alright, so this is what I was talking about. I needed to get Cell here up to purple style. And then uh, I gotta click on. I think it was. No, it's not that one. It's the party one. Right. Then the shield. Right. Oh yeah, I gotta replace him because I did Vegito up to purple style because he's just so damn good in PvP that I just had to do that. Ah, uh, so now that's up to 6,500. I now gotta work on the other ones and get them to purple star and then I can do the rest of them. Ah, uh, so I didn't have PvP time today because before I did that other thing, I had already done my PvP for the week. I'm up to, uh, six, I think, six position for this week. So everyone above that position that I can currently verse are at 2 million and 3 million <laughs> combat power. So there's no point in trying to fight them. I just got to maintain my 6th position. Uh, so I chose 3 different characters to do this even though it drastically reduces my power level. So we've got... Kid Boo, obviously, for the golds. Then we have Vegito for the uh, blues, because he is gold. And then we have red uh, go tanks for the uh, dragons, which are greens. And Vegito just looks so cool when he's doing these moves. That's so sick. I'm starting to think, by the way, that uh, with the Awakening events, we're probably going to get a Vegito Awakening, because you think about it, right? We've got Gotenks, then Gotenks Awakening, and now there's two other parts that we haven't got confirmed about what they are. So, it's either we're going to get Gods with uh, Vegito and Goku, which <laughs> would be awesome. But more likely, I think we're probably going to get, like, Super Saiyan Vegito, um... Maybe, we've already got Super Saiyan 3 Goku. So I'm not really 100% sure what the third one could be. I really do hope that they add the gods and Kefla and Kolifa and all that. They are some pretty cool characters. Oh, and Gogeta. We, we need Gogeta. Where's he at? And uh, Lord Beerus would be pretty cool too. I've already got him in Dragon Ball Legends and a lot of fun to use. Even though he is kind of a hairless cat that is a god of destruction, but still, he's cool. Oh. I'm also waiting 
if they did eventually put gods in, then obviously you would have to get a freezer gold farm, which would be really cool too. But I have no idea what's in store for this, and I'm still waiting for them to update the episodes as well. Like, it just says stay tuned, which kind of implies that our more episodes are going to add, but. I don't know when, I'm pretty sure we're in like the second anniversary of this game coming up to the third, I'm pretty sure. Anyway, it'd be awesome if they do eventually add more characters, because I'm about four away from finishing the whole collection. And then I don't know what I'm going to do, I'm just going to have to do them all up the gold star and uh... Try to uh, beat all the pay to pay to win players. Oh, I should also mention I'm very close to going up soul level, so that purple aura might change to gold. All right, thanks for watching.